a great day at 9A. This is a very, <laughs> very special great day at 9A. I think the most special one we've had yet. We are celebrating Scott's silver anniversary. The celebrations are only getting started, really. And we have a very special proclamation, which Caitlin is going to read. Caitlin, will you do the honors here? I'll come over here. All right, thanks, Nicole. Yes, so this is um, from His Excellency Ned Lamont, Governor. Are you You're ready kidding. for this? The are governor? You, are you ready for this, Scott? I'm so ready. An official statement that we are going to kick off Great Day at 9A. Whereas 25 years ago today, Scott Haney arrived at WFSB TV as weekend meteorologist in the years hence he has been a key member of the WFSB morning news team. This is so nice. And whereas with good humor and a sense of responsibility in those early morning hours, especially as he provided the citizens of Connecticut with important weather information to plan their days, and whereas he has shared that sense of humor with the viewers of Great Day Connecticut, and whereas he has embarked on bringing his sense of humor and responsibilities <laughs> to charities across the state of Connecticut, helping them raise thousands upon thousands of dollars. And wherefore, I, Ned Lamont, governor of the state of Connecticut, do hereby officially proclaim Tuesday, November 14th, 2023, as Scott Haney Day! Oh my God, I'm so excited. I can't believe the governor did all this. This is Scotty, so nice. Yeah, you're in the state of oh my Connecticut. God, and thank you, Susan Bysowitz. I'm sure you have a hand in this Absolutely. as well. Isn't that fantastic? Does it surprise you? Just, you know, I mean, things just kicked off this morning, but they're only going it, to. I, do you have your seatbelt buckled? I think I got my seatbelt buckled. I'm so excited. To, <laughs> I can't believe this is you incredible. Have this? Yeah, I got it. Hold it for just a quick okay. second. Okay. Oh my right, God. Well, we have another surprise too while we're still out here. Okay, this so is Caitlin's incredible. Going to be, uh, whistling, Look at this. Whistling it, something can, over. Can you see this? It says it's a, it's my day. This is awesome. And we need that hanging up in your house. Oh my soon. god, this is gonna go. Where where should I put it? Um, maybe above the couch. How about um, yeah, above the couch. Yeah, yeah. Okay, I like I'll that. have to do that. Yeah. That's incredible. Really. <laughs> or your entryway, your foyer. So oh my foyer. Oh yeah, that's a great right? place, right by my. Like, uh, I'm official. That's why I'm, I'm official. This is fantastic. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> now, uh, is there a Corvette waiting for me or something? Uh, not a Corvette, but another kind of whip. Another kind, kind of. of whip. Yeah. Okay, yeah. I'm, look, I'm looking forward to this. Almost like a Mustang. And thanks for making it in today. I oh, appreciate it. Oh, I'm that. happy to be here. Yeah, it's I, awesome. I couldn't miss it. I no. couldn't miss some of the celebration, at least. <laughs> and do you want to tell everyone who's waiting in the studio audience? I cannot believe it. All of my weather watchers are here. <laughs> Everybody got an invite to come, and most of them showed up today. From Jeff in Stafferville to Nancy and Bruce. I've, ne I've never met these people before. And how long have you been talking with them for? 20 to 25 years. Some of them, 25 years. And you're meeting them for the first time today. Yes, yeah, some of them are meeting for the first time today. We had a little get together around, I would say, about 10 to 15 years ago, and uh, it was at the uh, it was at the top of I, I forget where it was. It was back in Constitution Plaza, but uh, oh, wow. the, the, they came out. It was just absolutely amazing. But I've gotten so many new uh, weather watchers since that time right. that they have come to the studio today, and they went through the newsroom and they were like, "Hello, everybody, yeah. how's it going?" Which is <laughs> so fantastic. I love it. So there was a bunch of surprises this morning. A lot of people emailing me, and if you get if if you send me an email, I promise you I will get back to you. It's just taking me a little bit of time. And don't put anniversary in the subject bar because it, otherwise it gets rejected. <laughs> then people think that you're submitting an anniversary exactly, or a birthday. Exactly, which is a good... <gasps> do you, what do you see, Scott? <laughs> I see a horse. A horse. Of course, of course. It's a horse, a horse, of course, of course. <laughs> oh, my God. Am I going to have to get on this thing? <laughs> Thank you, Ernie. I appreciate it. Do you want a ride? Oh, I'd love a ride. <laughs> There's no saddle on it, which means I don't have to get up on oh, it. Oh, yeah, no. No, no rides today, Scott, but we have <laughs> horses from the governor's horse guard here today. So this is Colonel. Hey, how are you? You want to come say hi? Absolutely. Oh my hi, God, Karen. this is so beautiful. Hi guys. Nicole, how are you? How are you? Nice to meet you. So, can nice to meet you. It's a pleasure. Yeah. It's a pleasure. Nice to meet you. Major Zizinski from Major the first company. How are you? Thank there. you so and much. Can you introduce yourself? Yeah, Corporal Barian. Corporal Barian. Oh my. Thank you. Thank you both so much for being here. Can you tell us a little bit about the Governor's Horse Guard? Uh, I'll pass that over to okay, Major. Okay, perfect. Major? <laughs> so the horse guard is primarily a ceremonial <laughs> unit. Closer? Come a little closer. Can the horse come a little closer? Sure. Okay. What's the horse's name? It's Colonel. Over here. Colonel. We want to move over here a little bit. Okay. 
Excellent. Look at how beautiful that horse is. Oh my God, it's absolutely beautiful. And he's here for you. So Major, again, tell us a little bit about the horse guard here. So the horse guard is primarily a ceremonial unit. Yep. Uh, we perform parades, um, any type of a ceremony throughout the state. Um, we also do honor guard details and yep. color guard details. And we are also, uh, when we get called upon from the governor or the uh, general, mm -hmm. uh, we act accordingly in support of the state of Connecticut Fantastic. and the people. So how many horses are in the guard? Like this is Colonel, so uh, yep. tell us a little bit about him. So this is Colonel, he is one of our standard bred horses. He's our thoroughbred. Matter of fact, probably about 15 years ago, Scott came out and did a special I on remember. him. I remember, and I got, did I and get bucked? on Colonel. Oh, didn't he buck me? <laughs> oh my gosh. You, got, you, uh, you stayed on. I stayed on. You stayed on. Oh How gosh. are you? Very nice to see you, congratulations. <laughs> Thank you so much. Well, don't worry about it. I'll get you a little, <laughs> get you a little, little bit. Say hi. Hi. Can you introduce yourself to everybody here at I'm home? Lieutenant White, First Company Governor's Lieutenant Horse Guard. Lieutenant White, thank you so much. Thank you for coming. Everybody, thank you so Pleasure. much for doing oh this for God. Scott. Are you, how are you feeling right I, now? I love this. I love animals. I love horses. This is just absolutely amazing. Colonel, Aww. I love you. Can I give you a kiss? Oh, what a good oh, boy. Well, the, the boy. I thought you were going to ask him why the long face. Yeah. <laughs> horse, yeah, horse walks into a bar. And why such a long face? It's incredible. Thank you guys so much for coming out. I really appreciate this. Thank you. Thank how you many how, how many horses are in the guard in the guard? We have eight now. Eight, eight now. Eight. Wonderful. Yes. And they're over in Avon? Still in Avon. Still okay. In Avon. Yep. Have to get out there. Do you and check remember it out. doing the story? Oh, 100%. How yeah. long ago was it? I was it? scared. About 15 years ago. It was about 15 years ago. Years ago. With that yeah. Time. yeah. All it was right. incredible. Well, we're celebrating 25 years, Scott. This is just the tip of the iceberg. <laughs> we have so many more surprises in store for Scott on Great Day at 9A. One thing he does know about, he and Chief Meteorologist Mark Dixon look back at 25 years reporting the weather to us. So you're going to hear part of that conversation. Plus, more surprise guests oh, he has no hi. idea about. And throwbacks all hour long right here on Channel 3. So we're going to